Again, the great River Rouge plant of the Ford Motor Company is a beehive of activity as the new Ford V8 goes into production. The Rouge is a city. The Rouge is massive. It is massive. It's where Ford started making history. There have been exhaustive laboratory tests. Engineers have labored over every part of the car. Ford led the world in manufacturing. The whole image of what Henry Ford wanted to do was innovation. Growing up, I told my dad I wanted to work for Ford one day, and my dream came through. It's a major, major milestone. We've got 100 years under our belt. From the moment they broke ground here a century ago, Ford has been making history. The very first uh, item produced, actually, ironically, was not a car. It was a boat on July 11th, 1918. The Great Depression, the Battle of the Overpass, the boiler explosion of 1999. Through tough times, the Rouge has endured as Ford family. I am so proud of our heritage at Ford, but especially here at the Rouge. Assembly line construction, the V8 engine, windshield safety glass, and more than 28 history-making vehicles that made Ford a world leader in automotive design from the Model A to the F-150. Henry Ford's adherence to the $5 a day wage made people want to go to work at the Rouge. Ford really built the middle class. He created Middle America. He made things affordable for them so they could buy his own product. The people that worked at the Rouge could afford to buy the cars, and they could take part in the American dream. The Rouge is where Ford started mass-producing vehicles, and today we're building the best-selling truck. The all-new F-150 is the toughest smartest, most capable F-150 that we've ever built. Today, the F-150s come off the line every 53 seconds, and they're so much more complex. When I see a F-150 out and about, I, I think to myself, man, like there's a solid chance that my hands worked on that truck and that, and that's a pretty cool feeling. You don't stay on top of the heat by producing the status quo. From the aluminum to the mechanics. Ergonomics uh, innovation, such as the exoskeleton, a lot of robotics. Innovation for us is really our future. For 100 years, the Rouge has powered America, where engineering is in harmony with the environment. The porous parking lot, the green roof, recaptured aluminum. All these things enable the Rouge to produce the F-150 trucks in a much more sustainable manner. There's greenery on top of the roof and it's to help cooling and heating of the buildings. The bees help cleaning and sustaining the environment. Sustainability is, is really about making sure we take care of this environment that we have so that the planet's still here for our children and grandchildren. At the heart of production has been people. Four years. 22 years. 24 years. 24 years. 29 years. Ford is a family, powered by each new generation. We've always been the Motor City, and there is a certain pride in that. A 100-year legacy building for the future, with a hybrid electric F-150 that takes us further, and carbon composites that make us lighter. We really look forward to build the next best truck. The Rouge made history, and continues to shape history for our community, our country, and the world. The American dream is, is to have a better future for my kids. My dream came through.